Zoom, 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 let it go. What up, what, what, what up? You can't see me back again with The Last Federation, the indie release by Arkin Games. I'm gonna jump back in for where we left off, all right? Sweet mother of space sheep, it's the solar map. I'm gonna introduce you to this gradually. For now, a lot of this stuff is hidden. Don't worry about trying to create the Federation yet. We'll get to that later. It's not even an option yet. Right now, you need to worry about gaining credit to spend. And you also need to accumulate a goodly amount of influence with a few races. A humble suggestion is that you start by delivering spacefaring tech to the Skylaxians, Andors, and Politians, and then run some dispatch missions for them to gain more credit. Your current focus should be making yourself powerful and influential and as you complete missions and political deals, I'll open up more and more ways for you to do that, culminating in the option to try to form a fledgling federation. If you want to read this or any other message, just click your, your logbook. Okay, so that's how it's gonna start. Hey, make sure that you like, make sure that you subscribe, comment, just let me know how everything is going, man, how you feeling. Okay, so we're looking at some of the planets here these are the, the different planets of the different races that uh, we're competing against. Okay. Zoom in a bit. Uh, that's Leto. Uh, the Skylaxan homeworld. Okay, we may do what they said and start with the Skylaxan. The Acutians. Uh, they're kind of the main enemy. Birdless homeworld. Borine homeworld. Andor. Petition. Thoraxian, Eva. Okay, so the Skylaxian. So I'm thinking I may do that mission as they suggested. Let's click over here. And um, see, this race has not yet reached the stars. They'll reach the stars in 10 minutes. Okay, that's not too far. Um, I can help them by smuggling, or I can give them space faring tech, which will help them get into space quicker. I guess you get credit for that, you get favor for that. They're not spacefaring either. But they don't come for 35 minutes. They won't become spacefaring. They're 38 minutes, 31 seconds. Wow! So they'll be spacefaring very soon. 31 minutes, 30, an hour and 37 minutes. Okay, they're the only ones who are spacefaring besides me. Okay, so we're gonna look at the sky lag. Oh, okay, it's cool graphic. Cool graphic, okay. Location details, owner details, population, space defenses. Okay. So now that I clicked on it, I'm still learning this game. We're learning together. Okay, got inventory, disable planet overlays, enable. Okay. Disable armada. Planet detail. Okay, friendly acts. So you know what to do friendly acts, it looks like. Okay, feeling friendly, that's the spirit. If you're going to form a, a solar federation, you're going to have to make some friends. Credit is super important concept. This is your social currency, so to speak. Doing things for races that they appreciate, or in some cases doing things that intimidate a race can gain you more credit. You can then spend that credit with almost any race to get them to do what you want, or with mercenaries. Okay, credit is like social capital. Be warned, sometimes there are no friendly actions you can take with a race. Either you don't have anything to offer them, or they simply don't respect you basically. Uh, this is one of the many reasons that your influence with races is so important. Depending on the actions you take, your influence with a race goes up or down. High flu influence makes them cooperate, and then low, <laughs> they might attack you. So I can hire a diplomat, I can deliver spacefaring tech, which gains 14,000 credits. So I don't know what this does, but I'm gonna go ahead and hire a diplomat first. I'm thinking it's only 10 credits. Um, Part-time mercenary diplomat to interact with this race on your behalf will make them more likely to reach out to you with quests. Okay. All right, yeah. They reach out to me with quests more. It won't guarantee that I'm the only, I'll only get the quest, but you get favor. Okay. Uh, deliver the spacefaring tech. So my influence will go from negative 14 to 36, from neutral to light. They become spacefaring if they're caught by the accusations negative 70 influence with them per probe that catches me okay i'm kind of not sure how that works but that's okay 
if caught by acutions, negative 70 influence with acutions per probe that catches you. Oh, that's what his mission. Okay. The race will eventually reach the stars. Okay. So I guess I'll go ahead. Okay, so stuff just got real, maybe. This is either going to be incredibly easy or impossibly hard, depending on how many races are already spacefaring. Just be careful of alerting those spy probes and make your way to the drop zone. I gotta get to the drop zone. The spy probes for each race have a unique sensor test. Bullet patterns that they fire and foreign objects are detected nearby. If you get hit, um, if you fire on them, the probes will be alerted. The penalty for influence that the race Okay, for each, there's a penalty for each probe that I alert. The goal is to maneuver cleverly so that you get past the probe without any of them censoring you. Okay, so it's a maneuvering type of drill, at the very least, with as few positive sense in you. Early on, when you only when it's only a couple of races that are spacefaring, you may be able to just walk over to, to the drop zone. In that case, more power to you. Each one gets harder, so enjoy the ease while it lasts. Okay. Okay. Let me zoom out a bit. So it looks like I got to maneuver to a drop zone, but it's a lot of probes and they're going to be shooting out bullets of some sort as like a sensor. So I just got to avoid the sensors and get to the drop zone. If I attack them, um, I, they may come attack me, but if I attack them, it makes the influence go down or the more of them I get hit, the less credit I earn. So don't want to do that. So, okay. Okay, okay, okay. So I need to start moving. Okay. So my firing buttons. Okay. All right, all right. So I'm heading up. Okay, I think I see the little probes, bullets. Uh, that they use to test the area, test the region. Hmm, okay. One of the direction changes that they actually shoot. Okay, so they're moving. So, okay. So I really gotta watch how I maneuver uh, amongst that's the drop zone up there have to watch how I maneuver amongst these probes Okay And it does look like they kind of shoot in different directions uh, the bullets swerve out kind of curve left and right as they shoot at this one little break point. Like I'm going around Saturn's ring. This game has really uh, cool art. I dig uh, the way that they did the art design. Very nice. I'm trying to figure out how to slow up for a second pro bullets are shooting into the drop zone so I remember it said like G or Q you could press and it would like kind of skip the turn but that's okay that's okay Pi successfully jettisoned with technical documents we did it baby we did it Okay, cool, cool, cool. So that's the first kind of little mission to help you get some credit. That's fairly easy. The Skyloxians are now spacefaring. They are an advanced species and disapprove of your race's past actions. Mm. However, they may just be the key to forming a federation as their powers of persuasion over the other races are non-trivial. Okay, this looks like a good place to stop. We're going to continue on with the next mission in the next video. Looks like we uh, had success here. And um, 
we're gonna keep it moving all right you can't see me make sure you like make sure you subscribe 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 and check on the next video with this new space epic from the last federation all right i'm gonna get with y'all in a minute and you know what to do make your next move your best move peace you can't see me your favorite gamer Zoom, zoom, let go. Zoom, 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 let go.